Hey guys, Simeon73 here with another video. Today I'm gonna teach you guys how to fix an error code that PS5 users are experiencing at the moment. This has been going on for a while, but there's an error code that, I, that makes it so you cannot use an add-on that you used, otherwise known as uh, error code 10785678-8. Um, and this error makes it so yeah, whatever add-on you download, it, it just literally won't let you download it and it'll just say something went wrong and it just gives you no explanation. This video will teach you how to actually fix that without resetting your entire console, factory setting it, or any of that dumb shit. All you'll need for this is a phone, and that's it. And uh, this is actually a method no one's done, so I'm actually the first one to try this out, and it worked. And uh, hopefully this could spread around and y'all can, you know, use your add-ons, alright? Alright. Starting the video, as you can see right here, I'm going to go to my downloads and see this is the Doom Eternal campaign add-on that won't let me install it. And this is, yeah, this is the error code that gives me the same error code. And yeah, every time I press try again, it will just give me the same error message and I'll just literally never be able to, you know, download it. So to fix this error, first step is pull out your phone. Now, once you pull out your phone, download the PlayStation app. And once you open the PlayStation app, go to the tab on the bottom and go to purchased. And once you're in the purchase section, go all the way down to the game that you're trying to download with the add on that doesn't work. So I, mine's Doom Eternal. Go there. So I'm going to go to whatever download thing you got to go to. And then go to the, cancel the download and then reinstall it. Like just press download the console and cancel it again. And then once you do that, you go back to your console and actually delete the download off of your download, like off your console and stuff. And once you do that, you should be able to delete it and it will be gone. And then next step. All right. Once you do all that mobile stuff, I actually already did this part. But when you go back to the download tab and delete the other download that you were doing, like just delete the add on that you were, weren't able to install and they'll actually finally let you delete it, which it wouldn't let you do it before. So now once you finally delete it, just go back to the games page, go to the add-ons and download the add-on again. And now it should actually work. See, it's added download. Now it says it's ready to use. And there you go. Your problem has been solved and you don't have to factory reset the fucking console. Like the video because that's the least you can do to say thank you. Maybe comment. I don't know. Subscribe. I don't know. Do what you want. Have a great day. And yeah, see you.